Hey guys, so today I'm here and I'm going to be doing my July Boxy Charm unboxing here. Sorry, I totally did take a peek this month. I couldn't help it. Um, and just as a heads up, I'll still be doing probably some sneak peek videos and all that, but I am going to be taking a little bit of a hiatus from both BoxyCharm and Ipsy. If you guys don't know, I am doing a Project Pan series, and I'm not really getting anywhere if I keep getting all these monthly things. I do absolutely love BoxyCharm, and between BoxyCharm and Ipsy, I definitely recommend BoxyCharm more. No hate against Ipsy, but I do think you get a great deal for your money. So, without further ado, let's get into it. First things first, it is the Road Trippin'. Um, I kind of think that's really cute that that's the theme this month. And I'm going to get into it here. Yeah. One of the first few things that I did get was the Chilla Beauty Eyebrow Cream. And this does retail for $26. And it's actually really cool because like it's got the brush on this side. And then in the down here on the cap, inside of this is um, your cream. So that's where your little pomade and all that is. And what is this? Oh, I got mine in the shade Taupe. So uh, that'll work out perfect for me right now at the moment. But yeah, retails originally for almost $30. That's really expensive, but always worth a shot to try out. Next up is this Pharmacy Bright On Vitamin C Mask. Um, it looks really awesome. This is originally $38, which is super expensive. Um, this definitely looks really nice. I like the way this, this bottle looks. Um, I'm definitely going to have to take and uh, find out the ingredients in this, see if I can use this. But I do think it's cool. It says it's made exclusively for BoxyCharm. So that's pretty awesome because Pharmacy is, you know, a really well-known brand. It's sold at Sephora. So that's really cool to be getting some collabs like that with Boxy. Next is this... No Cosmetics Luminous Silk Compact Blusher. This originally retails for $11.99. I am actually not going to open this. Um, it does have argan oil in it. I am allergic to argan oil, so I am going to be passing this on. Um, I don't know too much about No Cosmetics, um, but sadly, I'm going to keep this closed. But it does look cool. It's Luminous Silk Compact Blusher in the shade Desert Rose is the one that I did get. I mean, it feels like it has a little bit of weight to it. The box looks nice, but... Like I said, I am going to keep that closed for now. And next we have this Wander Beauty Unlashed Volume and Curl Mascara. Sorry, I had to like really read that. This orig originally retails for $24. Sorry, I had to like double read that because the way my bend is on mine. But $24, that's, like, that's pretty expensive. Um, I kind of like how this is like the packaging is on this. I like how it kind of looks like a lip gloss. Um, actually, this was a lip gloss at first. Ooh, I like the mascara wand. It's got that nice curl. I am going to check the ingredients in this. I hope I can use this. That'd be awesome because I love it when they have that nice little ridge there. Perfect for the lower lash line. So, definitely going to check that out because that interests me. Um, $24. That's expensive. All right. Last but not least in the box. Super pumped. This is a crown brush. Fugo? Fugo? I don't... I'm not sure how to say that. Eyeshadow Collection. And this retails for $29.99. Um, this is pretty cool because normally we get a lot of crown brushes. And I didn't know that they did makeup like that. So let's see what it looks like. Here's what it looks like on the inside. You do get a cute little mirror. And these are some big size pants. Um, it's a really pretty neutral palette. Where my cat yelling? got lungs, right? He gets so upset if the attention's not on him. Um, sorry about that. But as I get into this, I do really like this. It's like the perfect, really pretty fall colored palette. Like, it's so beautiful. I can't believe I can't get over these pan size. Like, that is really big pan size. Um, definitely have to try this out. I'll probably try this out in an upcoming video. I hope it's good and, you know, it works out nicely. I really love crown brushes, so I hope so. So, honestly, I'm really pumped, honestly, just for this palette alone. Uh, I'm not sure on the other things. Well, I can use the eyebrow thing, I know, but, um, really pumped on this, actually. Super excited. So, this box was well worth it, and I think it's super cute. Uh, so, we got the palette. I always like to show you guys a little overview here. Uh, the face mask, which I am going to look up the ingredients, see if I can use, the mascara, the blush I am going to be giving away to a friend, and this eyebrow pomade. I'm actually really pumped, um, because I'm actually almost out of, um, my regular, like, just, like, brown eyebrow stuff. I do have some red left, but as you can tell, I'm more pink right now instead of red, so that would look kind of funky. But, um, super pumped, actually, so this will come in handy, and I'll definitely use it, um, hopefully it's good. 
All right, well, that was it for this month's BoxyCharm. Like I said, I'll probably still do some, like, spoilers and sneak peeks every now and again, probably, hopefully, like, at least once or twice a month, maybe, I'm hoping. Um, but, yeah, I'm going to take a little break from it for now, but I still do very much recommend it. I definitely think it's worth it, but I am trying to dwindle down this collection a bit, make it more manageable, and use it up. But uh, I don't get anywhere if I keep getting stuff every month. So uh, thank you guys very much for watching. I really appreciate it. And be sure to subscribe. There's new videos out all the time. All right, thanks, guys. Bye.